3D printed shoes are apparently the future of footwear. I disagree, and today I'm going to prove my point. That's because for the last six weeks, I've designed and printed my very own 3D running shoes to see if they can last a measly 26 miles. I spent two months and a lot of money getting these bad boys made. Produced by Childish, this is the Kamehameha 8000. <laughs> This is the first time I'm going to be seeing them in the flesh. Now, after about nearly two months, for the first time, I'm going to be seeing the first shoes I've ever created in my life. Let's do this. What? That's actually freaking wavy. The Kamehameha 8000s. Three, two, one. What? Oh my god! These are insane! These look amazing! Can't believe how these have turned out! This was printed and it looks this good! How am I running a marathon in these? That's impossible! That's impossible! <sighs> Yo bro, they need to be a half size bigger. They're extremely uncomfortable, yeah. These don't fit perfectly at all. I'll be surprised if we can actually run a mile in them, but we're gonna persevere. We are gonna conquer this marathon. Johnny, you are a professional coach. I'm gonna show you the shoes that I'm gonna be running in. You've talked a massive game with these shoes, and I'm very excited, so it has to be serious. Come on. Oh my. Whoa! I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> and they're 3D printed. <laughs> That's what, what I'm saying! Bro, I'll try them on. First assessment, by the way, is they are heavy. Yeah. So we're gonna get some serious blisters. Okay, and on that note, guys, we've got a contingency plan. We knew it wouldn't be fit for a marathon, so we need to do little steps to make it better. Mr. Jack, he is gonna make some alterations to the shoe to make it more culpable, and then I'm just gonna do a little test. When I set the camera now, should we do it? We get at least five miles. In order to even attempt this marathon in these 3D printed shoes, we must first make some alterations. If not, we could end up with some serious injuries. And if you think that sounds dramatic, then my friends keep watching. Foam to the side. He's got a good point. That's a point. After going over every possible precaution we can take, we decided we were ready and prepared to start the marathon. We are also competing against other people here. This can place me at a serious disadvantage. <laughs> this is bad. Oh. oh god, yeah, this hurts. Gotta go all the way up there and then go all the way around and then loop it around the vineyard and then it's one mile and then you just do loops. 26 loops, 26 miles. Okay, first mile. Let's go. <laughs> I feel like I've achieved a lot even getting here. Technically, we're not even on the route yet either, bro. Scale of one to 10, 10 being serious pain. What do you want? I'm on like a seven. Oh, no. It can hurt. <laughs> it's going to be a long day. I'm not even exaggerating. I've, I've ran 0 0.2 miles. Oh, my God. Oh, no. The pain is unreal. I can barely walk. <laughs> Let me try and read fast pain. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Oh, that is way worse than I thought it would be. I'm not even a mile in and I'm already regretting starting this challenge. Oh, what? Shit, that skin already. Like, massive rush. There I'm not willing to take an L. I'm coming to the realization, like, yo, like, it's not possible. I don't know if this is possible. Hold on, honesty, right now. These shoes, I'm in extreme pain. I'm just trying to be as, like, transparent as possible. We're gonna see how much we can do, but I'm not even a mile in and I really wanna take them off. It's pain. I'm hoping for a half right now. I'm begging for a 5K. Come on, come on, <laughs> oh come on. I, I just, I don't know. I don't know if I can do it. I'm in extraordinary pain right now and these shoes are impossible to run in impossible it's in oh, i'm in so much pain oh my god oh my god <laughs> nah, bro, I'm taking them off. I guys i was so close to calling this challenge off and then the man the myth the legend nigel came out of nowhere he is a legend and you're gonna see very soon why what size are they 10. oh it's a shame number nine 
Oh, no, you can squeeze into those. <laughs> you might squeeze into them because they, they do run a bit small. Yeah, try them on, be my guest. Wow. How do they feel? Heavy. But you could do a lap in them. Alright, I'll try a lap. Yeah, do you want what? to pop both on and do a lap? I'll try a lap. Are you serious? Yeah. I'll yeah try a lap. Go oh on. my god, okay. Do, okay. A, do a lap in them. I'll do a nine, then we'll see. Okay, alright. They look good. You on look you. really cool in them. They look cool. You do look extremely cool. Me and my new best friend Nigel have swapped shoes. This is Nigel's 110th marathon. He's currently on 37k. We've swapped shoes. I'm in these lovely hockers, living the dream. It's like my feet are in ice cream. And he is trading it for these little blister packs. Oh. <laughs> Nigel is such a legend. I honestly don't think I was even ready to carry on, but Nigel's given me the confidence to continue. Nigel, how are you feeling? I'm feeling okay, actually. But I'm not as bad as I thought they would be. It doesn't even look like you're struggling. I feel okay. <laughs> I'm so, I am so impressed right now, guys. Look at him still going. He's crazy. He's done it. How was that? Uh, different. <laughs> I'm impressed. That good. <laughs> you know what? The tray. I can't get over. Right, so, right. I'm so impressed. <laughs> He's killed that. He made that look so easy. <laughs> okay, so right now I am walking. I feel like I need to achieve something. My feet are just battered. Um, I don't know what else to say, man. Well, I, I need, I need those shoes. Oh, trust, <laughs> trust me, you do not want these shoes. All right, so. Because Nigel embarrassed me, yeah, and I've been running around in these boys, which are like elite. I'm gonna try these shoes on because he was crying like a little baby. Bearing in mind, I have stated that if this was a size half, like if this was 10 and a half, I reckon I'll be way better. Nigel has made us realize that this is not possible with just one runner. It has to be a team effort. <laughs> I swear that's blood. Yep, these are fucked. They make me so angry. Oh, I need to punch something. Oh, but if I punch those, I'll break my wrist because they are literally cinder blocks. Jack has volunteered to give them a try. I don't know how you've done as far as you have. <laughs> they hurt not even moving. Bro, these are bad. I don't even know if I can do one lap. I told you, man. It's not a joke because me and you are the same size, isn't it? Bro, that they is... need to be a half size up, isn't it? They need to be destroyed. <laughs> <laughs> they don't need to be a half size up. They need to be in the bin. <laughs> As you can see, uh, Jack is uh, struggling. He's already encountered a few issues. This doesn't look good. Ah, <laughs> I can't do it, genuine. <laughs> Bro, you heal. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> One lap. <laughs> what? Bro. <laughs> One lap, game over. I'm not possible. Oh my gosh, no it's not. I can't believe that. I'm not very happy. I don't know how to put this into words. I feel defeated. These, the epitome of pain. Can these do a marathon? And so collectively, I think over the weekend, these have done 7.5. Four miles. So, I feel like I need to share my pain with somebody. I'm confident, I feel positive. I wanna beat this challenge for you. I've gotta make these better than before. I've got these foam pieces that will hopefully make the experience way better. Oh my God, oh the pain. Oh, the pain. Oh my gosh, it's actually worked. But I just need to double up on that other side. All right. Okay, it still does hurt. It still does hurt, but it's it's way more bearable. I've been way over my head. Come on, shall we? Okay, but I need I needed moral support. Um, now, got you, man. Kamiya, eight thousand. Kamiya. The weight. Oh no. Oh. I'm running 
come for you. No. This man has actually got blister plasters to put on his feet to prep for this. That's how I know this is going to be bad, you know. What are you doing? I am... Um, Printed oh. my own shoes. Just about to be bought out by Nike. Now nah, it's oh actually pronounced. Say it again. I've got six miles. I needed this. I need moral support to finish this. We're gonna do it though. We're gonna do it. We've got six miles to meet the threshold for the half marathon. Three, two, one. The blisters are getting real, bro. Oh my god. How much further can you go? Ow! Ow! Tell me what you're feeling right now. I'm, I'm not good. I'm not good. These are half a size too small. That 3D printed shoe was actually made out of like some comfortable material rather than like that solid hard plastic stuff. That would actually be ridiculous shoes. You ready to give a little push? Yeah. Three, two, one. Come on, little push. Come on. Keep going. Keep going. Yabby, yabby, yabby. <laughs> <laughs> that was brilliant. This is his 500th mile. <laughs> I just lied to get approval from the audience. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. You right? I don't know, man. I, d I don't know. Right, we're going to do sprint intervals. <laughs> Eds, take me off, man. All right, pass me out. It's my turn. I'm actually really intrigued to see how that feels. How are you feeling? Positive, confident. I want to beat this challenge for you. Oh my God. This whole journey has been an incredible team effort. The half marathon in 3D printed shoes would not have been possible otherwise. Guys, let's give some love in the comment section for everybody that made this possible. I can tell they're already bleeding. <laughs> Nearly there. <sighs> ah, I'm bleeding. No, he fucking did it. Bro. Oh no! The hardest thing about that is the pain. You can't actually focus on pacing, which I'd say is the biggest part of running. That pain almost makes you out of breath alone. Don't know how the hell you've done all those miles and that. Well, technically it was it was it was all of us. So check this. GGs. Oh my god, I'm so sorry, bro. Also, guys, if you didn't know already, this week is the childish drop. 25th of June, 9 p.m. I'll see you guys there, and I'll see you in the next one.